Yo, this is W Soul 13 bringing you Rage Shadow Legends. So today we're going to be talking about um, the Brogni Fusion and the Champ Chase Tournament. Yikes. So it looks like our, my official estimate of 3,000 to 5,000 5, points is kind of spot on. Um, unfortunately, we're going to be on the high end of that. So what am I going to do? I am going to most likely go all the way for that Lego book at 3,000 points. Why? Because I have a lot of shards and I have some fusions that I can do right now. So let's do it. Summon Yoshi. That should be 500 points right there. Remember, Champ Chase is champs from any source, right? There we go. 500 points right there. And also, I have enough, almost enough, to summon Broadmaw, which I think an epic is, a void epic is 350 points. So I'm only looking for this guy right here, which most likely I will be able to pull while breaking mystery shards open, or I can just farm in the sewers. So let's go straight to the summons, shall we? All right. Let's talk about opportunity first. All right. So most people will not be able to do this fusion. I think that's kind of like baked in to the process now that most people will not be able to do this fusion. Wow, all rares. That's a horrible pull. So the other thing you have to look out to with uh, Champ Chase is um, how RNG um, dependent it's going to be because you're going to want the break epics open with your ancient charge. You're going to want the break legendaries open with your sacred shards which is why um, it's better to save your sacred shards for summon rush because you're guaranteed the 500 points there All right so 2500 here and then i'll need um what's that 2500 for summon rush so five sacred shards or mystery shards 2500 mystery shards right combination of mystery shards and sacred shards should should get you through um summon rush if you're looking to do this event i'm looking to finish it i think i'm gonna finish it and um i understand that a lot of people are upset about oh who we got who we got who we got Krila, <laughs> dupe Krila. unfortunate right there so see this this is where it gets a little bit testy because now i pulled a, i pulled a lego pulled some epics right probably over my limit there we go so here's the question do i keep pulling the ancients so i can get the 5500 extra lego book right or do i just save it for next time okay so from my perspective um I could easily just keep going and try to get the extra Lego book, but I'll have to think about it. I have to. I'll have to. I'll have to go to the tank for that. Mm. I think. Uh, I think I'll. I think I'll keep my shards from here. This is a good time to keep my shards from here. Uh, most likely, I'm going to be doing champion chase, a uh, champion tournament. Which is going to be another source of points for you for um, for this event because it is champ chase. You can get points from doing campaign runs. So if you are doing this event, um, I think 2,500 points is very doable, especially if you have ancient charts. Unfortunately, they did. Um, the 10x with the ancient shard double Lego in it. If you fell for that, well, you know, opportunities are is about looking for where you can make something happen, right? If you don't look, you don't find it. So this is a great opportunity for the grinders out there, the people that have saved up their resources. They're gonna get rewarded with a really strong champ, and if you can't make it through this event the way i look at it is they do a fusion every month anyway you know you can always get the next one as far as being an impactful fusion 
me personally, I miss Rotos when Rotos came out because I didn't have the progression level needed to get enough discounts on my resources. This was back then when we didn't have enough resources per day. And now that we have so much resources per day, it's really more just about your dedication to the game. Really, if you if you really want to pull for a certain thing, it's, it's really up to the effort that you want to put in to get it. And I think it's good that, that prayer, players are rewarded. And at the same time, I think it's this represents a gigantic um, shift upwards in terms of the cost of the fusions because before that 2500 got me an epic now i'm getting epic fragments you know i'm not even going to be able to pocket the epic after the event because i'm going to be using it to fuse brogby right so we'll see where this goes but i'm in good shape i hope you guys are in good shape as well